hello in this video i will show you how you can add text or other components on your google site website so let's see how we can do it easily so at first we need to log in our google site and then once we are there then we need to choose on which page we want to add the text i'm going to click the pages from here there will be three tabs are there on the google sites if you access it either owner or editor mode insert pages and themes we just need to click pages to choose the page where we want to insert the text so i'm going to click about us in this page i'm going to add some text to add some text we have to come this insert this option and then we have to click the text or we can double click it will bring this type of menu from here we can choose one of the thing so to add any text we just need to click text and it will bring us this type of window or text box now we can actually copy the text or we can write some text i already have written uh, this text somewhere else in an old file i just copied it and i pasted it here if you don't already have that code or text you can type it manually and here i just need to add those things one by one so in this way we can add a text now here we can also change the title of this page if we want right right now it is about us is very title style if it's very big looking right if we want to make it smaller we can also click here and from here we can choose the heading then it will be a small type of text and it will look nicer and if you want to decrease the uh, like this area we can also choose from this header type to like title only so it will be only like this you can also do but i'm not going to do this thing uh, this is fine i'm going to keep it like that now in this way we can add a text after adding the text we can also add another block of text to add the next block of text we can again click outside or double click here it will bring this type of thing or you can click this text it will be added this type of text boxes now here we want to add another type of thing like meet our team suppose we want to create another te uh, text block wh which is about about our team so i'm going to copy and paste from other part of the uh, document file i already have the word file i'm not going to show this thing i'm going to show you how you can add this thing now in this case uh, meet our team here we have uh, this block and then after that we have the text right so let me do one thing let me make it a title text or some other text like heading so i'm going to change it to heading and it will look like this and this is our text and once we put the heading basically it looks something odd right so here this is like big size this is also big size so both of them it is like heading so what we can do we can make it like title and then meet our team this will be like heading now it looks nice i in compared to this thing right so now in this way we can do this thing and when we are editing the text basically we can do many other things we can change the font size we can change the size of the font then we can make it bold italic or underline even we can change the color and also if you want to insert any link we can also insert the link and also we can insert some emoji and then this text can be aligned with this option option there are four options for alignment and even we can actually create a bullet list also like one two three uh this this is number list and bullet list is like this way suppose we want to add a bullet list so let's create another block so this time i'm going to click text box and it will be inserted like this and then i'm going to add some of the text so here i'm going to paste some text so this is the text so it is not properly formatted so i'm going to remove everything okay so what i'm going to do i'm going to copy one by one so that it will be easier to format so i just copied uh, each block of code uh, each block of line like this so now it looks nice right so let's make it like header headline i'm going to make it heading and then this will be the bulleted list right so we can uh, click this thing it will be bullet list and if we want to make it number list then we have to choose this thing one two three four but i'm going to choose the bullet list like this way so in this way we can uh, actually create the block of text in this way 
if we want to copy the entire block we can also do this thing so to this thing we have to select uh, the block and then here we'll find duplicate what will do it will duplicate the entire block so let's see uh, whether it will be able to duplicate this component or block i'm going to click here and see here it directly copied the entire thing and in this way we can also copy the entire block and if we want to remove this part basically this component we can also do two ways we have this option delete section or we can click this remove it will be removed okay both of the uh, ways we can do this thing and if we, here we i showed you to remove by, by clicking this if you want to remove from this area you can also click here and it will be removed and now here we have three sections up there right now let's change the color of this section suppose you want to change the color uh, of this section so to change the color of this section basically we just need to click here and then left side will find on section color option is there we just need to click here and from here it will bring all the available colors even we can also insert the image but i'm not going to insert the image rather i'm going to change the style or color of this section so this is the style 3 i'm going to choose and it will create this type of thing and it, this color it is bringing from the themes so here if we check carefully i'm using this theme right this is highlighting like this and this check mark is there so that's why it is like that color in this way we can also change the other color also like this this way and also this way same so now we change the color right and also change the text so now uh, if you want to move uh, this block to down or this to down we can easily do also if we move our cursor over there we'll see a couple of dots up there and the mouse pointer is changing here right it brings like four arrows together right so that means we can drag this thing top or bottom based on our own need suppose you want to move this thing to top so what we can do we can click here we can drag it and drop it before that right now see here it is removed uh, not removed it actually moved from this area to this area again if i want to move it we can actually do this thing and it will be moved like this way and finally it's time to save and check whether it is working properly or not i'm going to click publish and it will show us uh, what changes we made these are the changes we made and this was the previous outlook and there is a publish button so we just need to click publish and it will be published shortly and now if we click this arrow uh, next to the publish button and then we will bring it will bring basically this type of menus from here we have to choose view published site i'm going to click uh, view published site so it will open a new tab and here you will see the about us page is there with all the text which we added just now and that's it guys in this way we can easily add text and related components on our google sites website thank you guys for watching the video